see after we have uh, created the account then we are supposed to make a pitch page that means uh, basically your sales page which consists of two pages a pitch page and a thank you page so the pitch page is basically the sales page of your product the page which explains everything about your product and how they can order your product as, well, as for thank you page it is the page uh, where your customers will be redirected to after they make the successful purchase so after they have paid you for the product then they will be redirected to the thank you page so that will be the page where you thank the your customer and then you provide them with the download link of your product so basically you can see here in your pitch page as for, uh, in the sales page you have to provide a detailed description of the product and clearly state how much the product will cost and explain how the product will be delivered whether by email or web page and explain how long delivery will take whether it's instant five minutes or uh, longer and you also have to include your clickbank payment link so i go to uh, my dreamweaver okay this is an example of a pitch page or sales page of my product okay so it explains all about the products the testimonials all that and the most important part is this part okay remember you have to have a eight week guarantee now this uh, requirement you can see down here it's not here okay clickbank return and cancellation pro policy you must state that after 8 weeks all sales are final so this is important this guarantee or warranty period of 8 weeks is important you must place it on your sales page you can see here again it is written this is a summary of the uh, order form and you can also see here it is important to note that your product whether it is compatible with uh, Windows and Mac uh, and Macintosh or just Windows like mine is only compatible with Windows operating system and it specifically says over here after successful payment you'll be redirected immediately to the download page and I even create a separate frequently asked questions so this is optional but it's good for you to give as much info as possible to your customers so as to uh, reduce your refund rates so this is the order link order link using the clickbank can see here it's the order link that I've placed so you just need to put it over here link so basically we've covered A, B and C and D this is the payment link that you need to uh, copy and paste on your sales page like you've seen just now and basically you can just read all this the third is to specify a hoplink target URL we've done so just now in the admin area now make a thank you page you can see here thank you page on the thank you page you need to thank the customer for making a purchase displays display your email address or even your support uh, support email address and you can also remind the customer that is credit card you need to remind customer that uh, that is credit card or debit card or bank statement which will show a charge by clickbank or click or this clickbank.com all this must be prominent and if your purchase was a uh, for recurring product then make sure to restate the bill the rebuild schedule on your thank you page and collect additional information on from your customer if necessary and number six make an exit uh, exit link so I go to my thank you page okay this is an example thank you page you thank the customer you specify that the credit card debit card has been uh, processed 
and it is important actually to process to to state the, the amount for example it's 37 dollars just an example and the merchant name on your card or bank server will be either clickbank paypal or to check out via on this page i'm using these three uh these three uh, payment processes i'm using these three payment processes for the same product that's why i use a generic uh, thank you page but you can just uh, delete this you can just specify only one if you're just starting out most probably you'll just be using clickbank okay so you can just omit this and then this will be the do uh, download link to the product and since this is a zip file so I even explain give a URL for them to uh, download and install the software in order for them to unzip this uh, file in case they don't have it and this is just an explanation then this is also optional then I even put my contact information this is a support ticket system so it's not just an email address and remember Clickbank say you must have a exit link or just click here to exit make it a center page bold it make it more prominent and just put any link most probably maybe to your main site main product site and just save okay so just upload this thank you page to whatever location that you want and for uploading of files you should refer to the other video series